in advance as soon as a vaccine is approved. The administration will deliver it to the American people immediately. Distribution will begin within 24 hours. 美国总统川普在白宫记者会上指出，有三家公司的疫苗都在最后测试阶段，需要通过黄金标准与严格的安全检测。预计在今年年底之前将生产一亿支疫苗，甚至更多。We'll have manufactured at least 100 million vaccine doses before the end of the year, and likely much more than that. Hundreds of millions of doses will be available every month, and we expect to have. Enough vaccines for every American by April. 美国的第一批疫苗将首先供应高危险族群，目标将是身在第一线的医疗人员。对于外界质疑疫苗进度，美国疾病防治中心日前也指出，明年第二季或第三季才能提供全美国人疫苗。川普解释，专家的评估是根据平均速度来计算。目前疫苗工作二十四小时都在进行。川普强调，疫苗配发速度会比多数人想象的还快，而且疫苗接种也是自愿的，并不是每个人都会被强迫接种疫苗。美国的疫苗进度牵动美国大选选情。川普表示，他的政府团队以历史性的速度研发生产疫苗，包括病毒检测数量都是历史性的。然而，拜登当年对抗 H1N1 却连病毒名称都不懂。如果让拜登来对抗疫情，将是一场大灾难。The numbers are amazing. We've done a great job, but then you have to take a look at swine flu, H1N1, okay, which Biden calls N1H1. Because he doesn't know the name, the H comes before the N. It's very easy to remember. You take a look at the job he did, where his own people and the man that was in charge said it was a total disaster. 疫苗进度不仅牵动美国大选，在全球迫切需求疫苗的国际背景下，谁能够率先大量生产疫苗，更将左右国际局势，影响利和话语权。新唐人亚太电视，江子阳编译。